Hello, fellow mayors. Welcome back to the city of Avalon. On the Cape Apple map, the plaza is a promenade DLC. In the last episode, we took an in-depth look at Area 6, a beautiful beach resort area on the peninsula. I was multitasking when working in this area, building Area 6, 7, and the city airport somewhat simultaneously. And in this episode, I'd like to take a few minutes to highlight the airport. Blocked off this area here, labeled airport way back in the first episode. The airport is going to live in this area kind of between the dirt path here and the waterway on the right. I'm thinking the airport entrance and terminal will be where the dirt path is now and I'm going to run the Concorde along the rail. I've already constructed a rail tap off the main line for bringing goods into some cargo stands that I'm going to set up as export only. The runway will be along the shoreline here. I'm also going to bring in the metro line to the elevated airport metro station. as well as run a second airport express line from the Concord hub to the metro station here. Moving forward, you can see the airport is basically in and transit is hooked up. It has two runways, but I'm thinking I'm going to reduce that down to one. Now the airport is approaching the finish line. Added some props from the airport section to give us some detail on attracting risks and framed out some of the buildings at the entrance. And now I present to you Avalon Airport. I did some touch-up detailing, as well as connected the airport to the ferry and biking network, making this a great transit hub, as it should be. It has access to two metro lines, biking and boats, with metros connecting to trains at their first stop, as well as the campus, downtown, and beyond. A biking that runs along the rail right away, continues and connects with the area that houses the oil industry, as well as across the forestry area into the first area of town. Let's go ahead and check out the entrance. It's a nice road with trees as you enter, parking, a few hotels, the airplane museum, the headquarters, and the three helicopter stations. Let's take a quick look at transit. We have the exposed metro running to the elevated airport station, as well as this underground metro connected to this station here. The airport has three small stands, three medium stands, and three large stands. It also has two cargo stands set to export only by having the taxiway just leave the stands with no return path. Avalon doesn't need any imports. We're importing only five units of stuff, but the city could use easy access to export goods. These export only stands, as well as if you used import only stands, will completely eliminate all those 0% full cargo planes clogging up the taxiway. One-way rail track is connected to the airport cargo station. I was hoping that each direction would get its own spot of the cargo station, but for some reason, one side of the station doesn't work, so I had to connect both directions to one side. So not as optimal, but still working fine. Here, I just want to show you the taxiway. Planes have multiple access points to help move them along. I also added some fencing with the dirt path to represent airport security patrol route along the fence line, as well as a nice communication tower. Placed a bunch of boulders along the shoreline to help bolster it and prevent erosion. The airport is moving between 600 and 2,000 passengers. I think that will increase a bit once we build up downtown. 
Well, that's Avalon Airport. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to help out this channel. And as always, happy building.